Do you want to go grab some lunch? Not really. I don't feel like eating out. Oh, why is that? Are you not feeling good? Actually, I'm on a diet. So I'm trying to limit how many times I eat out. You have amazing willpower. I would have definitely given in. I just started my diet, so I'm not sure how long I will last, but I want to give it a try. Okay, we don't need to eat out today. Let's have lunch some other time. I really appreciate it. Which pair of earrings should I wear for tonight? Which ones are you thinking of wearing? I'm thinking of wearing either these gold ones or these silver ones. Well, what does your outfit look like? If you know what kind of dress you'll be wearing, it will be easier to decide. I'm wearing this little black dress. In that case, either gold or silver will match. I think I'll go with the gold earrings. They match the gold accents on my shoes. Are you ready to go to Eric and Ricky's? Almost. I'm trying to decide what we should bring as a gift. You're right, we shouldn't go empty-handed. How about a bottle of wine? You read my mind. Why don't we pick up a bottle at the liquor store? We're running a little late, though. Don't we have anything lying around the house? I have this bottle of sparkling grape juice. Do you think that'll do? They won't notice the difference. Good thinking. All right, let's head out. What are you doing this afternoon? I'm free. What's up? A bunch of us from math class are going to meet up for a study group. Are you interested? Oh, that sounds great. Count me in. I failed the last math test. It was incredibly hard, wasn't it? It was. My parents flipped out on me, and I'm scared to fail again. Don't worry, I'll tutor you. Let's meet up at 1.30 today. Ugh, I'm in such a bad mood. Oh yeah? What's wrong? I have to file my taxes. It's such a headache because I run a small company. It's a pain in the neck, isn't it? Do you have someone that can do your taxes for you? 
No, I don't have the budget to hire a tax accountant. I do it all myself. I don't envy you. Taxes are really hard to sort out. Yes, but we have to do them. No use in complaining, I guess. Hello. I ordered a party platter for curbside pickup. But I don't see anyone with my order. I'm so sorry about that. Could you tell me your confirmation number? It's 217357. Will it be ready soon? I'm in a hurry. I'm very sorry, but it seems your order was accidentally given to someone else. Seriously? I can't believe it. I've been waiting here for over 30 minutes. I'm terribly sorry. A new order has been placed for you. It should be ready in 15 minutes. It was our mistake, so your order is on the house. We'll even throw in some extra appetizers for you. Have a good day. What's the matter? You look like you're in a bad mood. I fought with Lydia. Really? But you are best friends and always get along so well. What was the fight about? We fought about who was going to drive to the store. It was a stupid fight. But I'm still angry. I'm sure you won't even remember this fight in a month. Don't sweat it. You're right. Maybe I should apologize. Yeah, you should be the bigger person. Did you sleep in your makeup? Yeah, I just fell asleep without washing my face. You know, you shouldn't do that. It's bad for your skin. I've heard that before. But is it true? Yes, it is. You should always wash your face before bed. Okay, I guess you're right. I'll wash my face right now. It would be a shame if you ruined your skin. You're still so young. I'll be sure to pick up some makeup remover at the store later today. Oh man, my head is killing me. Do you have a headache? I drank too much last night, and I have a hangover. I have a special home remedy for hangovers. I'm willing to try anything. What's the remedy? It's a special chicken soup that helps you rehydrate. Should I make it for you? Would it be too much to ask? Not at all. I'll prepare it right away. Hi, I'm looking for a book for my history class. Sure. What kind of topic are you looking for? I need a book on the history of Japan. Can you recommend a good book? 
how about this book on the Meiji Restoration? It's very popular. Actually, I used that book for my last history report. I see. How about this book on the Jomon period? Thank you. This is exactly what I'm looking for. You're welcome. Please bring it back by May 5th. So, I'm thinking of starting my own YouTube channel. Do you have any tips? That's exciting! Just remember that it's harder than it looks. What do you mean? For example, a YouTuber has to know how to use a camera. But did you know that they also have to know how to edit a video and thumbnail? It's a lot of work. I don't know if I'm cut out for all of that. You can learn it as you go. It does take time, though. Thanks for letting me know. I'll look into it a little more. That's a good idea. Can you open this link on your computer? No problem. Oh man, my mouse isn't working. I need to buy a new one. Oh, I think I have a spare at my house. It's used, but if you don't mind, you can have it. Really? That's so generous of you. You can come over today to pick it up if you want. I have a plan later today, but I can come over tomorrow. Does that work for you? Sure, any time is fine. Just shoot me a message before you head over. Great, I appreciate it. Did you hear last night's news? No, what did the news say? According to the news on Channel 5, over 100 birds suddenly dropped out of the sky. That's unbelievable. How did it happen? No one is entirely sure, but some people suggested that it was because they got confused. They didn't know which way was up and which way was down. That's a very unusual news story. I've never heard of anything like that before. Me either. How bizarre. There's a storm brewing. Better batten down the hatches. Storm brewing? Batten down the hatches? What do those expressions mean? A storm is brewing means that there's going to be a storm. Batten down the hatches means to prepare for difficulty or crisis. Thanks for explaining them to me. We should get ready for the storm in any case. You bet. 
I think we should go to the store and get some essential groceries. Good idea. I think we should pull the car into the garage as well. Good thinking. Let's get a move on. The storm will be here in about an hour. Yes, let's hurry. What's the best way to relax? I love relaxing with some candles and a good book. But I hear some people like to pamper themselves. Pamper themselves? How so? For example, getting a massage or splurging on a nice dinner. Those options sound nice, but I'm on a budget. How about watching a movie on Netflix? I relax that way after a hard day at work. That's an excellent idea. I think I'll watch a movie tonight. Maybe I'll binge watch a series for fun.